In this video tutorial, we will be going through the basics of creating your first project and assigning the workflow in XTM Cloud. Click on Projects, and then on Add Project to begin. Fields that must be completed are shown with a red star. Choose a customer, and a project name. Enter the source and one or more target languages. Upload your source file here. Multiple source files can be zipped together and then uploaded in one go. XTM will automatically extract the text from your source file for use in the translation environment. When your project is complete, XTM will automatically create the target document in the same format and layout. XTM supports a wide range of file types, Microsoft Office, OpenOffice, FrameMaker, InDesign, Excel, IFF, PDF, HTML, XML, TXT and TTX to name just a few. In the settings section you can choose a project workflow from a simple one-step translation to additional correction and review steps to ensure the quality of the translation. Choose which TMs and terminology you want to use for this project. Click the Create button and your new project will now be listed in the Projects tab. Click on it to access the project editor. Here you will be able to view general information, metrics that will be updated in real time and more. The Workflow tab is where you assign your project tasks to different users. If you're a freelance translator working alone, all steps are automatically assigned to you, so there is nothing to add. If you are working with other users, you can assign the steps of the project using this drop-down menu. If you want to split one step among more than one translator, then you can do so here. For example, we are splitting a 50-segment file into two bundles. What is more, you can modify the workflow steps if you're not satisfied with them. Click the Edit Workflow button to add or delete workflow steps or to set due dates for each step. Workflow steps can be active simultaneously or sequentially depending on the symbol between them. After all the tasks have been assigned, click the Start button. Assigned users will receive an email notifying them of a pending job and their assigned tasks will automatically pop up in their My Inbox tab. They can log in using their web browser and start working. When a user finishes a step in the workflow, the job automatically moves to the next step in the workflow and the next round of emails will be sent out. Want to push back the workflow one step? Simply click the red back arrow to reject the task and send it back to the previous user. Once the final workflow step of the project is completed, your target files will be automatically generated and are ready for download from the file screen in your project menu. Thank you for watching.